Hey, what's going on everyone? Welcome to NC Drums. My name is Nick Carruthers, and today I want to show you a double stroke warm-up I like to use on the practice pad. So this warm-up consists of four different variations of double strokes. The first variation is just going to be your regular double strokes leading with the right hand, right, right, left, left, right, right, left, left. The second variation is going to be inverted double strokes leading with the right hand, right, left, left, right, right, left, left, right. And the third variation is going to lead with the left hand. We're going to be going back to regular doubles, left, left, right, right, left, left, right, right. And the fourth variation, we're going to lead with our left hand doing inverted doubles, left, right, right, left, left, right, right, left. Now, this whole exercise consists of four measures. So each measure is going to have one of those var variations. So the first measure is going to be just your regular double strokes, right, right, left, left, right, right, left, left, leading with the right hand. The second measure is going to be your inverted double strokes leading with the right hand. And the third measure is going to be your regular double strokes again leading with the left hand. And the fourth measure is going to be inverted double strokes leading with the left hand. So we're going to be playing this at 30 second notes at 60 beats per minute starting out. So let me show you what I'm talking about. So what I love about this exercise and this warm-up, you'll strengthen your right and your left hand because you use the doubles on the right and left hand and inverted doubles on the right and left hand, or you lead with those. So it's fun and challenging and it vastly improves your timing. When I started doing inverted double strokes, oh my gosh, like it vastly improved my timing when I play with the metronome. Because when you do regular double strokes, you're just playing on the downbeat. And those are also pretty hard because you got to make sure they're even and sound good, basically. When you play this, just remember to keep your shoulders relaxed, breathe, and you know, just go with the flow. Uh, if you tense up, you'll sacrifice your speed, your flow, and your clarity with your notes. Uh, I, when I don't breathe and tense up, I could hear it for sure. So uh, what's really challenging about this exercise is that when you play inverted double strokes, it's gonna sound a little bit off with the metronome. So the downbeat's gonna land on one, which is a single stroke. And after that, you have more double strokes, except when you hear the one and two and three and four and on the ands, that's gonna land on the second stroke of the double stroke. You might be a little bit confused, so let me give you an example by counting it out and let me show you what I'm talking about. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one. So there you go. Alright everyone, thank you so much for watching. Please hit that subscribe button down below, like and comment on this video, and don't forget to hit that bell notification so when I upload a new video, you'll be notified. So keep practicing, stay amazing, and have a good one.